We go. All right. Check it. Yes. Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. And we coming back at you, man, with another Shabbat lesson. Before we get started, though, we're going to give all praise and glory to Yahweh. Yahweh. Give honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Shalom. Keep pushing. Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. To it because, like we was bringing out earlier, man, the whole uh, the whole summit up there in uh, Switzerland going on, you know. So, Esau Edo, man, he's going with his move, he's just laying it all out there. What do you want to do to the people? Keep working, you know. You want to give, he definitely on that uh, disinformation and all this kind of stuff, and, you know. But ultimately, we are we know what his you know, end game plan is, and that's the uh, you know, the MO. We can't say it, you know, the YouTube and all this kind of shit, but right. yeah, but it's gonna come upon the whole world, man. You know, every crack and crevice of this place on this earth, you're gonna be tempted of that. You even say that, uh, you know, the hour of temptation, pretty much. Right. You got that? Con. Okay, con. Revelation 3, verse, I'm starting verse 10. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation. Which shall come upon all the all the world to try them that dwell the, upon the earth. Okay, yeah, he's gonna keep the elect, you know, and the one third of the nation of Israel from that hour of temptation, man. Everybody outside of that, the two thirds of Israel, you gonna end up taking that uh that uh you know karatma pretty much, man. You know, you're gonna be a uh, number two to slaughter, whether it's gonna be the nuclear uh, ICBM missiles. You know, you're gonna get caught up in the uh, JT, the famine. The wild beast tearing you to pieces, it's gonna be no protection for you in that day, man. No, so you need to get ready because this is actually coming. You can actually check up, pull up a news article, and you can actually see this. You know, it's physical, it isn't actually in people right now. Ain't no more going around and just saying, hey, well, maybe, you know, that's what Pastor been saying 20, 30 years, you know, but nobody knows what it is. No, the man of the Lord, we're telling you exactly what it is now, man. And like I said, that whole temptation is gonna come upon the whole earth. Whether you are rich, small, and poor, which brother gonna get? You know, it, it's coming, and as a matter of fact, it's here at any day moment. Because uh, they talking about they gonna crash with the economy soon. You know, the CBDC. All that's got to do with the side of the tax. Yeah. And Jake's still horsing around, you know, pissing in the wind, thinking, hey, you know, we just out here talking, we wasting our time, man. Yeah. But you just gonna see. Okay. So the Revelation 13 to 16. Mm -hmm. Right? It said that he called it all those small and great, rich and poor, free and bonded to receive a karagma in their right hand or in their foreheads. Yeah, whether you're rich, poor, small or great, you know, it don't matter if you got that 300 mil football contract or you you damn working at a foot like a down there making, you know, 10 or whatever they paying down there, man. Everybody's going to be on the same level playing field at that moment, except for the elite, man. If you ain't the Rothschilds and Rockefellers and whatever the, the 13 ruling families they claim, every, everybody below that, they pope. Yeah. You the pope. Exactly, yeah. And you're going to have to get your ass branded, pretty much, you know? And and you got to say, hey, I love my master, pretty much going back in uh, like the Exodus, some other desert, or like an all or something, you know? They got to board. Yeah, board into you, board into you like they board that that ancient all into the slaves here to show who their master was and who they belonged to. Yeah, are you guys? So, look this up, Deuteronomy fifteen and sixteen. And it shall be if they say unto thee, I will not go away from thee because he loveth thee, and thine house because he is well with thee. Then then thou shalt take an all and thrust it through his ear unto the door, and he shall be thy servant forever. Yeah, instead of the ear this time, it's going to be in your hand, man. You know, and that's what our people going to say. Then they say, hey, we want Caesar, you know, as our king. So guess what? Jake wants the goodies to come back, you know, because all this is going to get off. Because he's going to put the pressure on you in order to take it, man. It's not going to be, oh, you know, fucking Burger King going to be wide open and, you know, the grocery store going to be wide open. And like, oh, here's this uh, karate, you want to take it? No, he's going to wait till you're at your weakest point in the flesh, man. He's going to say, hey, you can make all this come back on. You get all the goodies. You know, you can have the good old time. You can go back down to Bourbon Street and, and act the damn fool again if you just take this karag. You know, and the people won't fall for it. You know, especially our people. You know, they all just all about folly anyway. You know? Yeah. So, 
Okay. Uh, all right. So Revelation 13 and 16, and it says that he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a karama in their right hand or in their form. Yeah, yeah. They say whether your ass locked up or your ass ain't locked up, man. You know, he, he make it all. Rich, poor, small, great, stupid, deaf, blind, crazy. Everybody gonna get their ass tracked, man. You know, this man, he wants to know any and everything about you. You know, and that's all a part about it. You know, we, we know through it all the well of y'all by some y'all shot. Both sides of, you know, judge you niggas, but it comes down to it. Hey, even the the retarded people, they're going to put it in them. Right. If you're remedial, or, you know, you got to like, throw it off. You know, he, you know they slow, they remedial, they got a handle. He going to put it on them, man. They go. Chapter day three. It goes to that, that's it. I'm I don't, I don't get rid of it. It's a separation between this and this right here. So what the brother's going into, people that are paralyzed, you're retarded, got any kind of uh, memory loss, or you are back from you know, they're gonna display this miracle on a, on a worldwide scale. So people gonna be able to see this, be like, damn, I need to go get that. So the key word in that passage is cause. Something's gonna happen in the earth to get you people to, to uh to take this thing. He has to cause you to get it. It can come through famine, it come through those miracles, false flag, the false flag. Yes. Okay, because like the brother said, you, you Israelites is so easily influenced that it just it is it, it, uncanny. But I got a precept real quick just to back it up. This is Psalms 55 and uh and 20 and 21. It says the words of his mouth were smoother than butter, but wall was in his heart. His words were salted in oil, <laughs> yet were they drawn swords. So it's slick and it's smooth. We can get on there, sharp with that suit and tie. Look, we need you to do, do this right here. It's going to benefit you. you no, know, we want society to keep going. These Israelites who are saying, oh, not to take it, we're going to have something for them. They're the reason things cannot go back to normal. And you people are going to fall for it, man. Hey, Revelation 13 and 15. And those that would not uh, worship the image of the B-E-A-S-T -E should be killed. Uh -huh. They got start off. They already started off with the incentives. They gave you all the incentives. That was like Antiochus came in. That was the peaceful words. That was the peaceful words. I was about to just be straight aggression. I was going to triple you financially. I you going to turn the juice up on you. You're going to have to take it, bro. They're going to put you in a situation where you got a choice. Yep. For real. And that's the Lord calling you off, too. It's like, you got it. Hey, that's the Lord calling in the world off. Because, see, a lot of people. Believe that, oh, I could do this and go around this and find shortcuts and loopholes. It's going to get to the point that we're like, no, it got to get to the point to show who you serve. Yeah, right. Right? Because you can only serve man or the Lord. And the Lord, like, no, you're going to have to make a decision, man. It's no gray area. It's no gray areas with the Lord. And that's one thing about the Lord. I love it about the Lord. There's no middle area. There's no, there's no neutral. You can't straddle on a fence with the Lord. You got to jump on this side. Or deal with that side, man. That's it. You can't be lukewarm. You got it, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. Revelation 13 and 17. Yeah. Yep. Like it says, and that no man might buy or sell, right. save that he had the karagma right. or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Yeah. So you're going to have to have that, you know, karagma in order to move around in this new society coming, you know, the new order of things, man. <laughs> you know? And, and that's all to it. You know, it's not going to be no uh, underground market going on. You know, <laughs> that's what it's all about. He's coming to wipe all that out. The cash, he's coming to wipe that out. The coins, you know, Jake like to keep these fucking penny jars and shit. All that <laughs> shit going away. Man. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> you know? Yeah, yeah. All that shit's going away, man. Everything's going to digital. You know, like digital prison. You know, and we're gonna get to that later, but you know, <laughs> all that shit's going away, though, man. You know, you know, there's no way of getting around this. It's in the scriptures, you know. So it's coming, man. It's already here. It's already in the it's starting up, but it's gonna get to a point where, you know, it's just gonna be in your face, man. That's right. And you're gonna know that, hey, these men that you see out here that you laughed and scoffed, them, you know, pointed your fingers, oh, that's never gonna happen. Oh, I already got the uh. Mark, I used to in my cell phone, you know. <laughs> you, you think it's gonna see, you know? That's gonna knock on your front door. Yeah. Literally, you got these you gonna have these people, they're already chasing people down and you know, it's gonna get to the point 
to where the decision gonna be at your front door yeah. in your house, man. Yeah. Like, the whole house, in, no, inside your house, through your yeah. doors. What you're gonna do? Right. Like the brother said, you're gonna have to make a decision. Mm -hmm. Coming down to that one decision, who do you serve? You put that thing inside of your body, you're serving your your uh, your, uh, your allegiance to this whole society right now. Mm -hmm. The Lord is a jealous power. You don't put nothing over it. Even like the brother said, even in your own household. Look, baby, I'm not taking that juice. You gonna take it? That's on you. The separation has to be drawn. Go ahead, brother. I can say real quick, like I said, we, we got a, a clear cut example of what happened just now with uh with the Bank of America uh -huh. when all that shit shut oh, down. Yeah, man. yeah and, and me and the brother Kashaw, we was talking about the other day. Obviously, you can see his plan from a mile away. So he bought to get get away from the cash form of money. He bought to make it digital, and then it's going to come to a time that you're not going to be able to get your money unless you got that thing in you, which is control. Yeah. What's the whole goal of the of the of the C here? Control. Yes, he want to control everything. Like the man was saying enough. Uh, when they stole their money, took their money out their accounts in, uh, in, the, in, the, in the Bank of America. It was like, nobody is doing nothing about this. They were like, no, they're calling the operator people on the phone. They're like, bro, nobody's doing nothing. This is like, they, I got $1,500, and you got somebody else coming down. Somebody else. And nobody is doing that. The clerk's like, we don't know what's going on. They're like, oh, it's a malfunction. Yeah. So when Jay get to the point to where the money in his account get malfunction, Jay gonna sell out, brother. Right. He gonna he going he going automatically be like, "What I gotta do to get this money back?" Insufficient funds. Insufficient funds. So All he wanted was to withdraw ten thousand dollars. They said they didn't even have that kind of money. We can give That's you ninety. We can give you nine thousand four hundred. <laughs> and another thing is, you see all the trucks coming to the banks to get the money from them. Two and so. Now you get them. You get them right. Is a is a is you get them from these different uh, corporate businesses, yeah. and then you bring it to the bank. But right. then you see somebody come and get it from the bank. Yeah. Where are they bringing it at? That's right, brother. Right? Where are they bringing it at? They really getting rid of that shit and transferring it. it for what? Digital. That's right. We right. give us your money and we're gonna show you you got this on your app. Get your money, right? You deposit your money, and then they tell you download the app. So now it's like, all right, let me see my physical money. They're like, download the app, and we're gonna show you digital numbers on here. All right, go ahead, bro. Hey, back it up, man. You can look it up right now. Why you brothers right here? It's on YouTube. It's called the Fed Now app. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a card like that. It's at the bottom, bro. Hey, it's spirit. The Fed Now app. It's already happening before your very eyes. Cash is it's over with. <laughs> hey, you you niggas about to lose it. That holding up a bag, you know what I'm saying? With them stacks by years, that shit a wrap. It's gonna be what you gonna hold up now. Everything's digital. You gonna you gonna be the actual digital case. And they, <laughs> God, huh? God, huh? <laughs> they gonna they gonna they gonna be on like this. Yeah. You see, they gonna use like like we said that word calls. They gonna use a lot of you entertainers, fucking LeBron James, Rihanna, Nicki Minaj, Lil Wayne, you, Akun. Yeah. <laughs> they they gonna they gonna they gonna bring they gonna they gonna use y'all to persuade this whole the whole Israelite community to get it because y'all follow behind. You love them. rappers and all. Yeah, go ahead, huh? Just like in uh, ancient times, Antioch, they were the same. It's the same shit. Uh -huh. Send them people, your religious bigots, your rappers. There's gonna be a bunch of niggas on TV with the garage man making the shit look 
God, talking the ball with the garage yeah. in your hand, rapping with the garage with the garage you in your hand. You ain't dripping unless you chip. Yeah, you ain't yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, well, like, example, hey, no, no big surprise if uh, Wu Tang made that remix of uh, Cream, man. Instead of Cat, they're gonna say, oh, yeah, yeah. Man. yeah, right, right. Instead of Dow, Dow, Cream. Did you get it? You still on it? I'll get it after five. Yeah. 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 Let's finish this out real quick yeah. and then we'll jump. The last verse on it anyway. Uh, this is uh, Revelation 13, and I started at 17. And it said, that no man might by himself save that he had the Karagma or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Right, so we, we basically have seen who's going to take it and who ain't. Who's going to bend, who's going to fall. Lord just gave us the whole test run of how things are really going to go. And the majority of everybody took it. <laughs> That's how it's going to be. Yeah. Yeah, practice test. Yeah, immediately. Right? It says, here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast. For it is the number of a man. All right, so it's telling you right there that it's going to be a person. It's going to be an actual human being that's going to institute the system, bro. Hey, you got Bill niggas saying <laughs> the MOTB is sin and this, that, and the third. What are you talking about? Hey, and even though that, I'm just going to say real quick, Bill, Bill, uh, BG, the real BG came out with that patent, patent six, pretty much patent six six six, which dealt with uh cryptocurrencies in digitally inside people's bodies. The patent was zero six zero. It, yeah, it wow. came out to six, six, six dealing with cryptocurrencies, digitized in people's bodies. Yeah. And then, uh, with the CPF thing, Karagma hey, and on the barcode of it, and then it's six, 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 man. You know, so it all go back to Esau Edom, man. You know, yeah. UPC code. God, yeah. It's all Esau Edom, man. The so-called white man. You know, he's been called out. You know, it's, it's his whole MO right here, man. You know, his whole plan. You know, the, the NW0 and all this. And by you, I know you hold him, bro. You like, uh, this is, uh, you know, harping in on what, what Kaya was bringing out that at, at the end of the day, they're going to try to corner everybody, you know? They're going to corner you into getting that C-hip in, in living in this life, in this world. This is uh, Ecclesiasticus chapter 27 and 1. It says, many have sinned for a small matter and he that seeketh for abundance will turn his eyes away. As a nail sticketh fast between the joinings of the stones, so doth sin stick close between buying and selling. So, like I said, that's gonna be that's gonna put people in that corner. You know, either you're gonna sin against you're gonna sin against your how about shit how shot to maintain your lifestyle and be part of this world that is soon to end, or you're gonna, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. you're gonna and, and to and to protect your money. When you do get it, you send it against the Lord. See, that's and most our people gonna get it for funds, brother. Uh, like it's the business that talking. business that I was talking about, because I did a writer talk coming, and uh the name of it was Religion is your mother and business is your father. All right, because the protection of business or money or commerce is gonna what uh basically be people defense. They're like, look, my money is my defense. If this is the way I got to get my money, then don't we have to get it? Why would God say, don't get this? Uh, like, I'm going to be broke. I got kids. They're going to start bringing up the things that's surrounding them. That, And that's why he put everything surrounded by money. Notice that. Everything you got to get, got to have money is included. So once he do get you to take this thing, it's like, look, all your money have to go on. Is the, the, the new, the old way of money is no more. Right. So people going to automatically be like, I got to do it, Kaya. Like, what you want me to do? Like, this is no other way. So, again, that's a what? Cone and all. But many have said for a small matter. So, if you got $200 in the bank, because most of our people, and this is facts, Americans, Americans, 82% uh, don't have a $500 emergency in their bank account. No, this 82% of Americans, man. Don't have five hundred dollars emergency. So if emergency happen, they don't have five hundred dollars. They can withdraw the thing. So you mean to tell me you'll take that C here for one fifty in the bank? <laughs> you got a your savings got fifty five dollars in it. You gonna take the C up for that? Come on, bro. Jay gonna take that for twenty dollars, bro. They were taking the they were taking the hit for twenty dollars. <laughs> 
Yeah, he the trophy for, take, for taking for taking all for taking that thing. He said he gonna give you a year worth of free ice cream, man. Right? He was like, give it, give it to me. A year of free Krispy Kreme donuts. One donut a year. Come on, bro. Because many have sinned for a small matter, man. For to take that on um, that hit, that jump shot for a donut. You sin it, man. You sin it, man. You'll lose out the gate. So many, and they say, for the seed for abundance, many shall turn their eyes away. Go out to get abundant. Uh, go ahead, hit that, man. They're going to just turn and look the other way. Like, yeah. And they're going to, and that's another thing. Our people going to convince people to get it. Right. Once our people and relatives, like, how you don't got it? Like, I could do this, do this, do this. You yeah. basically going to be paralyzed if you don't have it. You're not going to be able to do right. nothing. Right. You're going to be able to drive, go here, do nothing, man. Right. That's how you know. When it get fully implemented, the law about to come back. Yeah, but it got to get fully implemented. But the law about to come right back, man. That's going to be the law coming, going to be about to get us, fellas. I'll be right side. Go ahead. This is the back of the article. And which ties to what the brother said. I ain't going to read too much because in this article, it states what the brother just said about those who even have that uh, the hokey pokey juice. When this thing hits, you're not going to be able to. Because they got records of everybody who took it. Yes. So you're trapped. You're not going to be able to go no damn well. Okay. Fly. All right. Watch this. It says, it says, it's from the Universal Basic Income, which is also known as the uh, World Debt Reset Program. It says, the new world economy includes the introduction of a digital currency, a universal basic income, juice requirements for travel, and the World Debt Reset Program. That's another, yeah. if I can add, that's another. That's another uh uh another another yeah. agenda or tactic they use in that you base universal basic income because what they're gonna do they're gonna put people on that brother yeah. and they and guess who they're doing that to they're doing it to them them women them single mothers that don't have no money right yeah. setting them up good so we give you section eight we give you the little six hundred dollars because they did they did in Atlanta when you look it up. We'll give you the $600, we're we'll going to give you the food stamps and give you the Section 8, and it's going to come a time to where, yep. look, we're about to take all that from you. They're going to automatically have to say, my kids, I got to do it. I got to do it. And most of them women is Jake's baby mamas, too. Jake don't want to say nothing. Jake That's our baby mama. So what you going to do? Yeah, go ahead, brother. <laughs> yes. Law, law going to try. Yes. brought it out earlier. Law going to try all his men. Hey. When... Hey, my kid, the kid got to get it. Yeah. And the, the kid, <laughs> the baby looking at you with the weeping eyes. I, I can't eat. I got to get this to eat. What you going to do? You're supposed to be the head of household. What you going to do? All right. But there's a little bit more and brothers got it. It says a continuous clutch. It's locking. A continuous cycle of lockdowns that's coming. Okay. Will eventually lead to an international economic collapse. It says governments worldwide will offer citizens here it is. Governments worldwide will offer citizens an alluring way out by promising to eliminate all personal debts, mortgage, loans, credit cards, etc. Buy your article. Okay. That, that's the smooth world like we talked about earlier, man. Look, we, we got we got a way out for you and the family and the kids. Yeah, make, 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 make it more convenient for you. That's right. If you if convenience, like you said, brother, just to add on to the boss off. Convenience is power, it paralyzes our people. Right. All right. And it makes us what? Not think. That's why many gonna go sit for a small matter, man. Because yeah. they it's convenient. Yeah. A, gift the heart. a gift destroyed the heart, man. So by it being convenient, that's gonna automatically make our people do what? Man, let me get that, man. Because our people want everything easy. You got it. They want to make life more easy for you. The whole yes quote of this whole program is to what? You will own nothing, and uh, you'll be happy. We're going to make life more convenient for you, man. Make, make it more smooth for you. But they fuck you at the same time. Because Esau know that you are like other people of the Lord. So you're serving him. Okay? You gave your, you, you pledge allegiance to Esau. You got it, bro. That's a miracle in the sight of the beast. But, but this, uh, this revelation slack is true. Oh, you had to get that too, bro. That, uh, Which one? That, that, that 13? Yeah, you in 13? No, I went oh, yeah. Okay, go. Cool. You like this? Got it. uh, Jeremiah 17 and 5. All right, it says, look, sometimes say, do not trust humans. It said, no trust in humans. All right, it says, thus saith the Lord, <laughs> cursed be the man that trusteth in man and maketh flesh his arm and whose heart departed from the Lord. 
I think that's that whole the system that you saw them set up. It, it, he didn't set up a, a system of dependency. So we just got to depend. Uh, and that's some curses at the end of the day. Uh, and the one of all things, you got to go from through your clothes, your food, your entertainment. Uh, you want to watch TV, you got to go to each side. Then this shit just coming out your account. A lot of people uh, auto pay. <laughs> this shit get hit, hit in your account. Now you're in the negatives out of nowhere. It's going, that, that's what he's going to do, man. Huh? Right, all those times you thought you didn't slid off with some the, the loan, you took a loan out. Oh, they didn't give me. You didn't slid with that. You didn't slid with that. Oh, they forgot to charge me for this. They're gonna hit you back, man. He took a fucking they got, loan. They got a task force coming for you, niggas who took that PP loan, like man. Twenty thousand yeah. in the hole right now. Man. Yeah, <laughs> they about to come out with that Corona. Get it all back in the end, you know. And that's what he wanted. That soul, man. When it boils down to it, because he little do you niggas know he, he wants that birthright, man. By all means necessary, he's gonna get it, man. You know, we can get that, uh, that, uh, that Hosea selected. Yeah. Hosea chapter 12, verse 7. He is a merchant, the balances of deceit are in his hand. He loveth to oppress. There you go. Yeah, hey, the balance of deceit are in his hands, man. You know, we're gonna tell you, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna eliminate your debt. You know, you're gonna be able to walk, you're gonna be able to read, and all this kind of shit when you get the, you know, the karagma in your head and all this kind of stuff. You no, know, it's just all lies, man. It's all deceit, man. You know, it's really about the oppression. And that's what it's all about, man. You want to oppress you so you know where you're going, where you came from, and all this other kind of stuff, man. You want to know how many times you've been to the toilet? You know, how much money you spending? If you're spending too much, you got to restrict your bank account. Target. Yeah. You ain't buying the stuff that he that he want to sell. Like, say, friends, he got something on sale. You ain't buying it. Guess what? You got to cut your money off, man. You going to buy the shit that he's selling you, you know? You ain't going to be able to buy... Uh, the shit that you, that you like, yeah. you're going to buy the shit he likes, man. You know, it can continue to uh, boost his profits, man. That's what it's all about. Oppression and money. You know, hey, exactly. like five minutes, y'all can just run them. Oh, you know. God, I just got to say, back, back up your point, now. You, you just want to feel like the most high, bro. Because they got this uh, this thing called a uh, data brokerage, where basically the, the elites, they buy and sell uh, information. Uh, you like it every average day purchases shit like that shit that you like and you wonder why you see an ass for this man you, you you're looking up some shit on your phone now you're seeing a commercial about it all these things are talk uh, yeah. 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 you're talking about some shit you're thinking about some shit now, now you're seeing it on the tv yeah uh, get it get a piece you're just thinking damn a piece would be good right now now you're seeing a, a domino's ad man <laughs> you'd be, th you'd be thinking about it. Uh, i was say the inward thought is hot it's deep you even thought that far <laughs> It's out of the book of Psalms, chapter 21 and verse 9. It says, Thou shalt make them as a fiery oven in the time of thine anger. The Lord shall swallow them up in his wrath, and the fire shall devour them. Their fruit shall thou destroy from the earth and their seed from among the children of men. That's the point. It says, For they intend evil against thee. They imagined in a mischievous device which they are not able to perform. Hey, and ultimately, this devil, he's gonna set up this device, this system, this B system, all right? And it's gonna it's gonna be moving, all right, but it's not gonna hit its fullness, all right. And that's what brothers, you know, you gotta you gotta pray that you endure to the time when when Yahweh he decides right, enough is enough. Because it's it's scripted that this devil is not going to complete his enterprise. He get He's not going to fulfill it. He's not going to perform it. You know, so they gonna get it in though. He gonna get it in. He gonna get it in. And a lot of you niggas is gonna fall, all right, within that short time. Because hey, once you see the the see him getting uh, implemented, all right, in these different stations that they gonna set up. You gotta already know, bro. It's gonna be over. It's gonna go fast. It's, it's gonna be fast. fast. Once that yeah. comes, oh, it's yeah. gonna. Cause we gotta get Abu right. Rakazah. Yeah, the elect gotta get saved. So if the whole think of this, the elect being 144, we ain't numbering this brother. You're just thinking if the elect is 144,000, let's say we don't we don't see them all. That's a small number. So if the whole world or the whole cities and where these men are at has it. And everybody know you don't have it because you're not in the database. You're the enemy. It's like it's like at some point everybody gonna say, "Get him!" You know, oh, you know, like everybody gonna be after you, man, because you don't have it. Like you are against it, and they are gonna paint the picture with defacing. They are gonna paint the picture with he's a terrorist. That's he's right. against this. He's against that. And our people gonna do what? Cleave to they to the devil. 
That's right, brother. Because that's their fault. So they're like, look, he right. Why would he wouldn't want to get it? They ain't talking about that Bible stuff, that spooky stuff, you know, and all that. Like, so they're going to put targets. They're going to make you a target if you don't got it. All right? You're not going to just be walking around. Yeah, you ain't got it. Willy nilly. Everywhere. No. They're going to be like, scan it. Because anywhere you go, you're going to have to scan. There's going to be security clearances. When that's out, it's going to be drones. Like, uh, what's that? Code 8? That movie Code 8? It's going to be riding around. Looking. Move it, gonna start moving, and all of them gonna start coming. So you know the Lord got to be in the presence, like that's why when he's about to fulfill his belly, the Lord gonna get him, bro. That's right, bro. The Lord gonna get him. You got it, bro. Okay, the said, I read it earlier. It's all the Edomite Tony Blair. <laughs> it says Tony Blair calls for a calls for a digital infrastructure to monitor who is juiced and who is not. For the juices that will come down the line, so they they want to monitor through a digital infrastructure to track everyone who has took that or uh, who has been knocked up from that juice, and they got like I said earlier, they got reports of who 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 got it and who don't got it. So we start looking at the record like them guys who are out there talking about this. I don't see none of their damn names on the list. So we know what's coming down the pipe, man. They're gonna put you on the TV screen, blast you. Look, y'all want things to go back to normal. They holding y'all from, from going back to normal. That's gonna call people to come against you. You gonna have walk, gonna have hits out on your head. People wanna kill you. Okay. They're the problem. They the, they are the problem. That's right. Yep. You got it, brother. She can to come back to normal. Oh, real quick. Uh, I'm gonna have said uh uh I think did a video on it. It's not gonna be cool to be a uh, to be an Israelite. Some some things of that to that nature right now. They can walk around with a garment on and fly and this and everything like that. We're going to see in that day, okay? If you're going to hold it down and be that same guy. All right? We got it, bro. Let me take that, that fame out of context, bro. This ain't just going to be like no Chris Brown type of fame. It's going to be like some infamy. infamy. You're going to be famous for, for being a criminal. <laughs> That's how Yahweh Shah was. Yeah, Yahweh Shah was going. They was always trying to tackle him and put their hands on him and do this. And that. That's what we're going into. Yeah, he, had to, he had to use spiritual. He had to disappear and shit, man. Yeah. They wanted, they wanted him, bro. So if they was after your house shot, think about us, bro. You know, the servant is not above his master, man. Go ahead, bro. Get up, get it, get it. Get it. it passed. Or right, come to an end with that, bro. Right, so Job five and twelve. Right, it says he disappointed the 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 devices of the crafty. So that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. Yes, yep. He taketh the wise in their own craftiness, and the counsel of the froward is carried headlong. It's the NW zero, man. You know, he ain't gonna be able to perform that enterprise. You know, he's gonna get a chance to actually sit down and see it come to you know for tuition. You know, he's gonna be like, Oh man, I got it all in place. But as soon as he get ready, you know, cut into that state, he didn't like, oh, I got it, it's all under control. The nuclear missiles gonna come, man, and knock him out of power, man. You know? Yeah. Yeah, hey, this so-called, we want you to go ahead and go ahead and kick it off, man. Get ready to cash. You know, they already said, that one of the brothers posted the video said uh, they taking the uh, Federal Reserve stamp out the building and all this kind of stuff. Oh, the plate or something. Yeah, so, yeah, and then they said uh, the CBDC is pretty much coming no matter what. Matter but, whether you like it or yeah. not. Yeah, so it's all here. It's all in place. We just waiting for them dominoes to fall, man. So you can keep fucking around and just, you know, thinking ain't nothing gonna come to pass, but literally, you know, it's coming uh, coming to pass right before your eyes right now. You know, and uh, if anybody else got anything else, or all, all right. the bullshit in Davos. Oh, yeah, yeah. Speed things kinda. up. Kinda. Stop kinda. buying all them prostitutes. Kinda. Get the business. Stop the business. Because at Davos, like many brother were talking, all they got, it's a global summit, right? So when you read Daniel the second chapter, it speaks about those ten toes. You got a nation that is all of ten, you got everyone from each one of those nations talking about this digital infrastructure and they moving forward with it. All right. You even had the guy, you all Harari, speaking on the global floor, floor saying, look, we, we got to get this. Or uh, they you know they talked, they didn't they didn't actually put it on the TV, but you know they talked about it in the meeting. Like, look, we got to get this karagma inside of these uh these people out here, man. That's the main goal. That's the whole agenda of, of, of that uh of, of, of their wealth, of the NWO, is to put that karate inside of you. Can't make it more simpler for you niggas, man. Yeah. <laughs> they're talking about getting rid of the word. Yeah. 
getting rid of this information and getting everybody to see him. That's it. That's the whole basis of that meeting they've been having. Yeah. And they don't need they ain't really really they don't need to meet because they already been counseling since oh, yeah. 18. <laughs> they just put that meeting out there for us to just be like, preoccupied no with some shit. We just gonna yeah. put this over here. We know everybody will jump on that. But the real shit happened behind closed, they don't put that out. Nah, All right. That real shit that see them secret councils, yeah. nobody know about them. Micah chapter two, when it is night, they when on oh, their it's beds, it's they pray. Oh, you got no, it. Go. It's still a job, but it's, oh. not, it's tying in what she's talking about. It says they meet the job five and fourteen. It says they meet with darkness in the daytime mm. and grope in the noonday as in the night. So how they meet with darkness in the day? That's a play on word right there. They doing some dark shit right in front of your face. Yeah, but talking about some dark shit, bro. It's like they practice it. <laughs> yeah. And, oh, yeah, like, I'm just gonna say that Micah two. It says on their beds they practice it. What y'all were saying. The real talks are happening in behind the scenes, but when they practice it in the daytime, that's your Davos, your WEF mm -hmm. meetings, where the average commoner, the, the peasant, the yeah, peon the peasant, can the see it. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's the small people. The people that's really the hitters, right. you don't see them. You don't know their name. You don't, we don't, the committee of 300 of these niggas, we don't know them. Them is like ghosts, man. Like, you, we don't really know them, man. Like, we don't, like you say, a, a, a illegal walk by us, we wouldn't know. Yeah. We wouldn't know because they hide themselves, man. All right, but nonetheless, a dog, the Lord, the Lord is overshadowing darkness with light. So at the end of the day, they see they secret put they the Lord have lift up their skirts, man. They see the secrets out. So whether y'all have y'all meetings or not, or whatever y'all won't do, it don't matter. Your kingdom about to end. Yeah. It's the end of the kingdom. The you know, I then took away the, the queen, one of those kings. He took away David Rockefeller, Evelyn yeah. Rothschild. So y'all, y'all got to do something. Is like we we got to at least see something. We're gonna die off, and when we <laughs> and when we go to the spirit, but what the hell is funeral? Say see nothing. Exactly. Bro, eat live about everything. I don't drink like bro. I don't trust nothing. Eat, show, and tell like. Something behind that shit, man. It's something behind it, you know. <laughs> Go ahead, bro. It's a rock twelve or ten. We gotta get out of here with that. It says never trust thine enemy. It didn't say sometimes or uh, 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 you know just at this moment. It says never, never, never. ever, <laughs> ever, yes. ever, ever, never trust thine enemy. For like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. And I'm gonna jump down real quick to verse seventeen. I spoke earlier about uh. Now, Esau trying to make it more convenient for you, for you, for you tribes, man. Okay. It says, if adversity come upon thee, thou shalt find him there first. And throughout their universal basic, basic income, they're telling you that look, we don't you don't have to own anything. Okay, you're still gonna be happy, but at the same time, I'm setting you for a trap because I own you. I have that jab inside of you. Okay, you're finna get this karagma, you're not gonna be able to do anything, okay, because we're gonna track you. That's what it's all about. That woman, that woman at the uh, at the World Economic Forum said we have a, a chance to uh of this infrastructure to uh to uh, basically have a near perfect record of every transaction of what's going to be happening, man. That's total control. All right, a society collapse. It says, and though he pretend to help thee, he shall slack it. Yet shall he undermine thee. He's pretending to help you, tribes, man. You're pounding back, or oh, everything's going to be okay. I'm standing for the fuck over you, though. Because Esau know once you take that device inside of your head or your hand, what's going to happen to you? But you don't know. He knows, but you don't know. But we'll give you the warning before it happens. That's all. You see the same bitch. She, she already says a bunch of y'all are going to die in this transition. Like, majority of people are going to die. My like, God damn. <laughs> she literally <laughs> says that, bro. My like, God damn. Yeah. Yeah. And here we are again, you know, warning you so called Negro Latinos and Native Americans, man. What's coming down the pipelines? You know, and, and y'all just fucking take it for granted. Hey, we're gonna go and get out of here, man. Hey, anybody got anything else? No, nope. I got it. Revelation it came, 18 and 9. It came back around. It, it came back. Put the debt you take. Just as that. Came back around. What you said, <laughs> Jake. Jake, like you just said, Jake be bringing out. We be bring, the prophets be bringing out the message, but Jake don't want to hear it. Jake say it's, it's 20 years down the line. But well, this is what the Most High has to say about that. This is Ezekiel chapter 12. I'm going to start at 21. <laughs> no, get, get to the point. Okay. 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 Okay.
and, and, and the word of Yahweh came unto me saying, son of man, what is that proverb that ye have in the land of Israel saying, the days are prolonged and every vision faileth? Tell them therefore, thus saith the Lord Yahweh, I will make this proverb to cease and they shall no more use it as a proverb in Israel, but say unto them, the days are at hand and the, and the effect of every vision. It's the time of this prophecy is getting fulfilled. This is no more play time and talking. It's an action, lights, camera, action. Yeah. yeah. So we're gonna wrap it up, man. Hey, we pray this video was edifying. You know, uh is is it? It? okay, come. All right. Yeah, we pray this video was edifying, man. Before we get out of here, we're gonna give all praises and glory to Yahweh. Double honest to the apostles of the Elder Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to the Sons of the Akim, man. Keep pushing. Shalom. 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 Sh